to find um, equations of tangent and normal lines from a given curve by using two techniques. One is by using our um, CAS calculator page and the other one is by using our uh, graph page so that you can see a more graphical representation of what the, um, the curve, the normal line and the um, tangent line really looks like. So first, let's take a look at the question. Find the equations of the tangent and normal to the curve of y equals to 5 log e x plus 4 at the point where the graph crosses the x-axis. So in order for us to find the equation of your tangent line or the equation of your normal line, the first step that you need to worry about is obviously the x-coordinates, where this um, tangent and normal line will going to cut through your curve. So um, the first step is I would like you to open up your calculator page and we were going to define our function by simply assign f of x equals to our rule. Once you've done that, now what we need to do is we need to find what the x coordinates equals to as the curve cuts through the x axis by simply use the solve command. So we're going to hit menu, menu algebra as usual. So I'm going to solve my f of x equals to zero and um, I would like to know where the x coordinates is. And as you can see, um, the equations of our tangent and our normal will going to be at x equals to negative three. So the first thing that I would like you to do is we're going to find the equation of your tangent line. So in order for us to do that, it's very straightforward. I would like you to hit menu and we're gonna go down to number four where it says calculus. And then we're gonna go down to number nine where it says tangent line. Alternatively, just hit menu and physically push number four and then physically push number nine and that will going to get you the tangent template. So once you've got the, um, the tangent template like such, the syntax is pretty straightforward. All we're gonna do is tell the calculator, please sketch the tangent line of my curve f of x, for which x is at negative three. And that's all there is to it. So you need to remember the syntax. And as you can see, the output is y equals to 5x plus 15. That is the equation of your tangent line at x equals to negative 3. Now we're going to do the same thing with um, finding the rule for your normal line. So we're going to hit menu again. We're going to go down to number 4 where it says calculus and option A as our normal line. Exactly the same case syntax as before. So we're going to go normal line at my curve f of x where x will going to be at negative 3 and then we're going to hit enter and as you can see the corresponding um, equation of my normal line at x equals negative 3 is negative 0.2x um, take away 0.6 and you can sort of like tell by looking at the slope of your tangent line and your normal line as well as we've learned m normal multiplied by m tangent should give you negative one in order for these two lines to intersect at 90 degrees angle. And if you just do a little quick maths, five multiplied by negative a fifth, which is negative 0.2, that should give me negative one. So we know that we actually um, expect, you know, we expect to have these two rules as the equation of tangent and the equation of our normal. Personally, I prefer to do it um, to find these rules um, by our calculator page over the graph page, um, and you'll see why later. Because it all it's sort of like automatically outputs the rule for you, but um, if it's on the graph page, you then have to extract it out. So now let's move on to step number two, which is using our graph page to get these two rules. So open up a graph page for me, and we're going to type in our rule. And our rule is 5 log e x plus 4. Let's 
done that. Let's just hit enter. So this is our curve. So what we're going to do is um, in order for you to um, draw the tangent line, what I would like you to do is hit tab and you should now have f of 2 being our equation of the tangent line. And on the graph page, you need to know that if you hit menu, can you see that we don't have the option of algebra? And then, you know, scroll down to number nine to get the tangent line like the calculator page. So since because of that, what you then need to do is you have to use your catalog button to actually get that tangent line template out for me. So your catalog button is simply just the book button. So you're going to hit the first tab and just type in the letter T for tangent and we're going to scroll down to find the tangent line template. We're going to hit enter and with regards to my rule, the same CAS syntax, so it's going to be f of 1, x and then comma, the x coordinate, it will going to be at the point x equals negative 3. So the calculator will draw that tangent line out for you. Just take a note here, can you see that in f of 2, it doesn't spit out the rule for you, but I'm going to show you how to get the rule in a minute. So whilst we're here, I would like you to hit tab again um, to call out f of 3. And in f of 3, we were going to sketch our normal line. So the same thing again, we cannot use it in, uh, the menu and then, you know, number 4 for your algebra and then down to the letter A for normal line. Um, it's not an option here on our graph page, so instead we just have to use the catalogue. And still um, picking the first tab, and I would like you to hit the letter N, and we're going to find the normal line template. So normal line here, I'm going to hit enter. Normal line of my curve, which is in F of 1, um, at the X value equals to negative 3. And the calculator will going to sketch it for you. Sorry, I'm going to typo here. Alright, so there we go. So keep in mind, again, that in F of 3 and in F of 2, none of which is actually spitting out the rule for you. And that's actually not very convenient, isn't it? But the nice thing about doing this on the um, graph page is that you can physically see sort of like the graphical representations um, of the relationship amongst the three graphs. In blue, that is your curve. And obviously red, that's your tangent line, which is a linear line that just cuts, just touches your curve at uh, one point, meaning at x of 3, negative 3. And your normal line, which is another linear line, which will be a perpendicular line to your normal, uh, to your tangent line, sorry. So that makes a 90 degrees angle right there. All right. So what we're going to do is we would like to find the equation uh, of your normal line, meaning F3, and we would like to find the equation of F2. So if you're going to do this on a graph page only, um, what you then need to do now is you need to open a calculator page to extract these two rules out for me. So I'm going to go back to my calculator um, page before. You can open another one if you want, but I'm just going to use my existing one. So my um, tangent was actually in F2, so just hit the variable button. F2, hit enter, it will rip it out for you, so just like before. Isn't that nice? And then I'm going to hit my variable button again. I will then going to hit F3, and I'll don't forget to type X, and the calculator page will rip out the equation of the normal for you, just like before. So that's a very simple, nice and easy way to find the equations of your normal and your tangent line from a given curve. And that is the end of my tutorial. Thank you.